what's going on guys scarf chomp gaming here and today we're bringing you a polyper damp rock rain team it's got the drizzle to set the rain turn one we got floats on the back with the swift swim wave crash um fun team here we got an annoying dragonite we got a really bulky guard chomp but really the main focus of today's video as Pelipper and how much damage Surf in the Rain does, as well as a Hurricane that cannot miss. And then there's always that Terra Ground, super convenient, especially when Electric types are on the field. Really fun team, guys. Pelipper, definitely MVP of this team. Pairs really well with Garchomp, you'll see in a later video this week, but super fun. Um, really good to use. You can always go Pelipper, Floatzel, King Gambit. You can lead Garchomp and bring Pelipper, Floatzel in the back. Uh, we got an annoying, really interesting balloon set there just for funsies um, but yeah guys that's the team hey by the way if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed please take those five seconds out of your life to hit that sub button if you want to see more 3v3 rank singles content not only does it help me it'll help you get uh, some of the most recent teams we're doing taking on the ladder helping people get the master ball tier we're trying to grow battle stadium singles it's not as popular as vgc so it's it, it's cool if we can help grow that uh, check out battle stadium singles on reddit uh, great resource there as well, but uh, other than that guys, let's jump into those battles Okay, so we got a mono fight team Honestly, I want to lead Garchomp and just Just because I think they're gonna lead Palmot because they see the Pelipper But I think since we're Terra flying Dragonite like We should be fine Although, if they do lead Palmot, I'm definitely going to terrestrialize. Then we're just hitting with a Terra Blast that's not anything special. We kind of got to make up our mind. I mean, King Gambit for sure is not coming. Like, I'll tell you that right now. Um, Let's bring Pelipper. Let's bring Dragonite. Let's bring Floatzel. Let's just see what happens. Let's see what our opponent does here. Oh, weird. Look. Scarf Chomp called it. Guess what? We're gonna tear a blast. This guy's like, ah, crap. There's almost a thousand percent chance that this thing is focus sashed. Now he also could go for fake out, but I just, I don't see that. Yeah, it goes for the double shock. Again, we could have let guard chomp there, but no EQ. There is the predicted focus sash. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. S no, I'm not gonna swap. I'm just gonna go for a friendly surf. Yeah, I'm sure he has close combat. He might be. S yeah, we could have swapped in. We could have swapped into Dragonite there, and just taken him out with the Rocky helmet, and it would have done like. A fraction of what that was, and we'd still have a full health Pelipper. It may have been the play. What do you do? Uh, definitely want to hit this Hurricane, but I'm pretty sure that he's lucky that hit. That misses, he's in trouble. Alright, I'm gonna tell you, there's almost no way this thing is surviving a uh, wave crash. It's gonna be 
straight up with you. Not in the rain. Unless you tear her into water, but even then. Not happening. Raw power. Alright, who are we bringing out next? It is the Hariyama. I was a little nervous that this thing was coming. Just because it's so bulky. Oh, he hits us with a fake out. Probably trying to stall the rain. Because uh, that may have been the last turn of rain. Does have the old flame orb. Might be going to normal type here. Who knows? Steel type. Good typing. Going for a bullet punch. Aha, the old... The old priority. We do survive with two HP. We just hang on. And oh, look at that. We get him so low. Floatzel's actually going to take himself out, but uh, that burn, you may not be able to recover from that burn. So there it is. We will win without a Pokemon on the field, and Floatzel will pick us up a win. Very lucky on that bullet punch, however. We had Roosting Dragonite in the back. A part of me really wants to bring Breloom and just start setting up. But, uh, eh. Wingle is the obvious lead. Sorry, Pelipper. <laughs> we should run Eviolite. Uh, Wingle. That would be just absolutely silly. Um, and then let us bring... Who are we bringing in the back? I almost think we bring King Gambit. We do have Breloom. But we're not going to be able to sc sc uh, spore much, so let's bring all King of the Gambits. It will be interesting to see who they lead. And I am expecting a Baxcalibur. Or Glamora. Alright, so they stick with Glamora. The question is, do we go, do we tear a ground? Not much wants to swap in to surf in the rain. I think we have to go tear a ground. Tear a ground on Polypher is so good. Here's the thing, it's either going to set up rocks, which we don't really care about. No one on my team, like, really relies on being full HP, like, we're literally suiciding float soul, so like it's not a huge deal, and that's what I was worried about, because that might have one shot at us, and now it's not very effective. And now we're hitting you with a surf. I mean oh, no focus sash. Ooh, that was a bigger play than I was thinking. We avoid any entry hazards, which at the end of the day isn't a huge deal, but we still avoid them. I like seeing the people through Pelipper's big ol' snout there. Look at them getting all pixelated. It's about how the game runs. Am I right? Okay. Here I am, rock you like a hurricane. Good damage, good damage. And we got the Dondozo confused. Nothing like a good confusion. Hit yourself, hit yourself, hit yourself. Atta boy. Oh, we've got the old lefties. That's fine. Let's go for another hurricane. Crit would be insane. Don't get it. 
He is confused. Does it again. That sucks for our opponent. Um, and honestly, the bird can run this way. I'll be honest. The bird does tend to run this way. Gets freezes when you least expect it. Gets, uh... <laughs> our opponent just cancels the battle. Fair. We didn't have a great Don Dozo answer in the back. However, Kauto Cleave does hurt. Haven't brought Berloom even once. Garchomp, Pelipper, Floatzel. Let's do it. Rain Team Unite. Garchomp lead because there's just too many other threats. Too many threats. Actually, Pelipper lead might not have been bad, but when I see uh, Dracopult, I get a little nervous. There's the Palmont. There's the Garchomp. Do you have anything that resists? Uh, 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 we could just hit the Stealth Rock. Because he might switch into... Oh, he carries Ice Punch. What do you know? Well, at least we got the Rocks up. That's what all the kids are talking about at school. Wasn't ready for the Ice Punch. I should have known it, though. That's a good Garchomp counter, but uh, this one's bulky. We could hit the Earthquake, but what good is that? I thought for sure he'd be switching in uh, Corvic Tank, which I kind of feel like he might be now, so maybe we should have gone for a Dragon Tail. Nope, close combat. Is it Ejecto Pacto? I don't know how obvious this is. You almost have to know though, right? Like if I see a Polipper and I've got an Electric Mon out, it's almost obvious. Goes for the Double Shock. We got him there. Doesn't affect Pelipper. It just doesn't. That's how good he is. Take it out the Palmon. Really want to see Corporate Knight here and not later. Um, that thing's kind of a problem. Mainly because he's faster and can just hit, uh, oh, interesting. That's going to give us some options. If he goes electric. Alright, pure ice. I get it. Ooh, goes for a dragon dance. I don't know if that's your play, dude. I don't know if that's your play. Uh oh. Uh oh. Duck, 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 Hit yourself. Yes. Pelipper, you insane bird. You are the reason to get up in the morning, Pelipper. Can't wait to run Evo Lightwingle. Don't tell Pelipper though. Alright, 
Last mon is Corvic Knight. Perfect. That works out real good for us because we're just going to spam surf. And it's going to do a lot. Ooh, we outspeed. That's huge. Goes for an iron defense. I can't. I can't fault the guy for that. But it's a little. It's too little, too late. And our opponent cancels the battle. GGs. We do get a lucky confusion, but hey, that's part of it. All right, guys. Well, there were some of our Polipper battles. Like I said, super fun to use. Uh, Terra Ground really can throw people off, and that Surf in the Rain just hits like a truck. It is so good. Damp Rock makes that rain stay around forever. Super fun. Let me know what you guys thought of the team. Give it a try. Let me know how you did. Would love to know if you made it to Master Ball Tier with this team, because this team tore up Master Ball Tier. Super fun to use. Um, but yeah, let me know what kind of teams you guys are working on. Would like to know that too. I'm going to try a couple rental teams that have been uh, suggested to me, so... We'll have some fun with that, but uh, yeah, other than that guys, I don't have a whole lot. We'll catch you in the next video.